So, let's see what we got here. <clears throat> Secret Lair Commander, Angels. They're just like us, but cooler and with wings. That's a lot of packaging. It's pretty nice. Poster, life counter, that uh, looks like the ones you get with the pre-cons, <coughs> let's see, I hope the foils aren't curled too much. can definitely see the foils a little bit curled Gisela, the broken blade both these are sticky cards Bruno, fading light <clears throat> and the foils Archangel of Doom Court of Grace really nice artwork Commander's Plate Angel of Finality Angel of the Ruins Arden Angel Breathkeeper Seraph <coughs> Dawnbreak Re Reclaimer Valkyrie Harbinger Angel of Destiny Angelic Field Marshal <coughs> Chain of Sight, Emeria Shepherd, Righteous Valkyrie, Seraph Sky's Blade, that one is nice, Angel of Serenity, Angel of Vitality, and Treat the Angels, Shattered Angel, Sunblast Angel, then Angelic Accord, Austere Command, Griffin Airy, Invoke, Invoke the Divine, Path of Exile, Sarah Ascendant, Stornheim Aspirant. Yeah, this one is a must in all Angel decks. Swords. Plowshares, Arcane Signet, or Flowing Shadows, Hurling Blade, Lightning Greaves, Marble Diamond, Mindstone, Ketras Monument, yeah, this one is nice, Pearl Medallion, sorry, Swiftfoot Boots, Well of Lost Dreams, Emeria Sky Ruin. Peru, Myriad Landscape, Shrine to Nyx, Path of Ancestry, Seraph Sanctuary, 
Ayane, the strength of the pride. <laughs> I'm, really, I'm a little bit unsure if I should keep this one in the deck. You gain life equal to the number of creatures you control plus the numbers of planeswalkers you control. Create a 2 2 white cat soldier creature token named Ayanis Pride Mate with whenever you gain life, put a plus plus counter on Ayanis Pride Mate. If you have at least 15 life more than your starting life total, exile Ayani. Strength of the Pride and each artifact and creature your opponent controls. To me, this card is not that good. I would, I will switch it out for something else. <coughs> Bishop of Wings, the Book of Exalted Deeds, Cleansing Nova, Dawn of Hope, Dismantling Waves, Giada, yeah. The easy way would to use this one as the commander for this deck, but it's not as cool as Bruna or Gisela. Keeper of the Accord, Kindred Boon, Nyctos Paragon, Search for Glory, Speaker of the Havens, Talas Lancers. Cosmos Elixir Endless Atlas Maze Mind Tome Sword of the Animist Tome of Legends Ursus Incubator Really good card Vanquisher's Banner Arc of Oraska Wonders Enclave War room and then tokens. Serious blessing, monarch, angel, spirit, angel, soldier, angel, soldier, warrior. Griffin <coughs> Yeah, here's Ayanis Pride Mate uh, Spirit and then we have the last card which is Sigarda's Aid. Oh that's a good looking art. You may cast Aurea Aura and equipment spells as though they had flash. Whenever an equipment enters the battlefield under your control, you may attach it to target creatures you control. Yeah, that that is also a good one. Yeah, so that's it. Let's look at <coughs> Brisella. Might not be the best commander, but definitely the coolest angel of commander. <coughs> the plan is to fit in this one. I was in Angel of Hope into the deck. And maybe use it as a commander just for fun in some games. But yeah, I really want this one into this commander deck. Yeah, so that's it. Thank you.